Right, Cliffy, a 6-1 win here this evening against Oxford Sunnyside in the Middlestar Cup. Do you want to give me your thoughts on the game? Yeah, I thought we... Uh, well, first of all, we, we, we tried to give minutes to boys that haven't been getting so many. First 20 minutes, 25 minutes, I thought we were very good. Um, then the levels dropped. We thought we became very passive, weren't putting tackles in, and it just was like day and night from the first 20. But then the last 10 minutes, we seemed to we seemed to up a wee bit, but we didn't really have a major major threat. But to be fair, the, the, the guys come on, we brought a few guys on, and uh, just just everything left it, the intensity left it. Um, there's some lovely football played tonight. So there was, and I know, listen, there's levels in that, but if your attitude's not right against a lower level team, you'll get found out because they're coming and it's their cup final. Um, and it's very easy if you're a higher level player sometimes to just maybe go out and you know you're better, but maybe a wee bit casual. But to be fair, I think it finished very convincing. Could have been more. Um, but the most pleasing thing was some of the football was fantastic. Young Ben Wiley. Um, Got his first 90 minutes a night. Tired a wee bit near the end, but he was absolutely super through the game. Um, Owen McCall, really, really good second half. Uh, Ross Ribbon, I thought, had a really good game too. Um, I could name quite a lot, but just sort of ones off the top of my head. But all in all, it was professional performance. You talk about some of the some of the football played in the second half. It was probably that hour mark when, the, you know, I think it was Josh Ukak came on and... Um, Ahu Obakan yeah. came on as well yeah. and there was a couple of changes like you said the intensity lifted scored three goals I think in the space of, of five <laughs> minutes I was commentating as well as trying to do the social media I and I, I didn't know where to look at, at one stage I think there was smoke coming off my phone but um, some of the goals were actually particularly I think it's, it's Shane McCartan's goal was a lovely yeah. goal in, involving Jay Riley yes. Ahu Obakan and, and Shane McCartan and I think that's the thing you know Jay Jay has come in and Jay has worked so hard in pre-season he really has he, he came here at the end of last year came back from uh, Airdrie um, and he had a lot of work to do and he put some work in during pre-season and, and listen Chappers Chappers in there right back and Chappers is steady Eddie every week um, and Jay knows he has to wait his chance but we believe Jay has all the attributes to step in when needed like he's you seen there the night like he's, the lad's boundless energy you know, he must have run the full length of the field between a, a couple of wee layoffs and then uh, Shane McCartan finish. Um, and you can see, that, you know, we've we've been doing an awful lot of work on the attacking side of things, and, and you can see within the final third, you know, the the one two touch passes laying ends, and it's it's all it's, it's not it's not it's not easy to try and get it going because you're not full time. You know, and you're only getting certain lengths of time and on a Tuesday and a Thursday night to try and build like patterns of play. But you can see it, even over the last couple of games, you can see it starting to kick in in places. It's not fluent by any means, but you can see them starting to take on board, which is really pleasing from our side. There's obviously, we, you know, we're delighted to get the win tonight and into the next round, but there's obviously bigger fish to fry, and we had the Taylors Avenue on Saturday to play at Carrick Rangers. What's the thoughts going into that one, Cliffy? Yeah, um, I think we have to go into... Well, we go into every game, and, and listen, whether it's Linfield or Zantorn or whoever it may be, and uh, we believe we can get something from a game. Um, Carrick are a big, big, strong physical side. Um, listen, they, they they play they play a certain way, um, and it's very effective. And they've 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 experience and quality. You know, they have Heatley there, they have Allen, they have Gibson, and and many others. Um, guys at the back, and and listen, they're well seasoned pros. Um, and it's going to be hard. And we get down there, it's going to be hard. And the, the day they finished and finished in the, the playoffs, but so anything we get down there will be well deserved. Problem. Thank you, Cliffy. Thank you, mate.